So physical activity more than 150 minutes per week or increase the activity level by more than 60 minutes per week. It's a decrease the serum amino transfer level independent of the waste law. It's a exercise frequency of five times per week consisting of the moderate exercise. This exercise are carrying live loads and riding in pie at a steady pace or playing the tennis for at least 10 minutes which are our greatest benefit in prevention of the nephrology development. So when you have the calorically restricted tire, 750 kilocalories per day plus uh, 200 minutes per week walking exercise result in the weight loss and to decrease the histopathological improvement in inflammation, ballooning and fibrosis and improvement in the liver palsy. Number two, treatment as an insulin sensitizer. But um, metformin is now recommended to treat the NASH in adult patients as a SRT guideline. But pavlitazone, this improves the liver histology in patients with and without type 2 diabetes mellitus with, with the policy prevent NASH. But, uh, risk and benefit uh, are very common, so they are discussed with each patient before starting the therapy. Until further data support, safety, efficacy of the biogidazone. So, the biogidazone should not be used to treat a nephrology without policy proven NASH. Vitamin E, number three. Uh, as a new, uh, pathogenesis of the fat, fatty liver disease, Oxidative stress is a very important one. Oxidative stress is considered a key mechanism of hepatocellular injury and disease progression in subject with NASH. So, vitamin E is uh, one of the antioxidants. It is investigated as a treatment of NASH. Many of the studies are in the, the whole uh, worldwide. Most studies were relatively underpowered and did not be or published. Uh, as a steady consult criteria for clinical trials. But uh, this limitation, uh, vitamin E is uh, as a um, main use for the use of nerve uh, and nephrology disease. The use of vitamin E is associated with decrease in amino transferase and also many of the studies show histological improvement in vitamin E. Because of the vitamin, after giving up the vitamin E, improvement of the steatosis, inflammation, inflammation, and resolution of the steatohepatitis hepatitis in many of the patients. And also, vitamin E did not have an effect on hepatitis. Seafarm, caring for well being.